1963, Jean-Luc Godard brought this now cut scene into the world, symbolizing his radical, provocative style. Three years earlier, his first full-length film, Breathless, broke the perceived cinematic rules of the time, setting the visual aesthetic of the new wave movement. It's a film that was made as a reaction against everything that wasn't a done thing, almost systematically. We don't do a close-up with a wide lens. Well, then let's do it. And for me, this corresponded with a desire to show that everything was allowed. Born in Paris in 1930, he was brought up in Switzerland by a well-off family, an enigmatic character, in line with the spirit of his films. Jean-Luc Godard called for a more political kind of cinema. In May 68, as civil unrest spread across the country, he addressed a crowd at Cannes Festival, calling for a boycott. There's not a single film that represents workers' or students' problems as they are happening today. Not a single one. We are out of touch. In 2010, Godard presented his film Socialisme to the Cannes Film Festival, then Goodbye to Language in 2014, which won the jury prize. In 2018, he won a special Pandore for the image book and went on to receive a César and an Oscar honoring his career as a whole. Crowning a leader of the new wave movement who tore up the rule book, telling the world that cinema could be whatever you want it to be.